Hey guys, it's Bang for About PC Gaming here. About to get into some Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands for closed beta. So going through the settings I'm using, I'm playing at a resolution of 2560 by 1440. V-Sync and frame limit is disabled. I haven't messed around with the FOV, just left it at default. Going into the graphics tab, Anti-aliasing method is temporal AA. You can opt to use FX AA if you wish. Ambient occlusion method is HBAO plus. You can use something else if you do have um, non-NVIDIA hardware, so not to worry about that. Um, everything else is at very high. Anastropic filtering is at 16 times. Motion blur is disabled as I don't think it adds anything to the game personally and god rays are enhanced you can reduce these to just on if you wish um, and everything else is maxed out so from a perspective of, of actual in-game quality this is the maximum you're pretty much gonna get um, so um, I'm playing with, with a single GTX 1080 SLI is disabled on this game it does work but at this moment it's um, it's not optimized enough to to play and it really does break the game so I've opted to play with one GTX 1080 and to play at 1440p so looking at actual performance you know at the moment I'm in the low 40s a very demanding game and the CPU usage is pretty well um, distributed across all my cores and threads which I like to see so um, quite a highly threaded game as well So in terms of scale, this game is simply just huge. Um, there's so f so much miles you can travel, and the map is just absolutely massive. So you do need to get around on vehicles, um, or you'll be running for ages. So I think we're in Mexico, and we're looking for some guy from this drug guards cartel that's um, obviously got some information that we need so I'm going to try and get to him great the performance while traveling on a vehicle is not so great on foot you probably do get a few more FPS I think there's a few guys there getting tortured so, I'm not too happy about that. It's like they got one guy strung up. Yeah. I see a second target. Roger, let me get in position. That's a kill. Cartel's coming down hard on the province since our last stop. They're trying to make a stop. They just made a huge mistake. Yeah, they tortured the hell out of this guy, man. Look, he hasn't even got a jaw. They literally cut his whole mouth out and stabbed him and shot him a few times so obviously they're trying to make an example of him um, so yeah not great but anyway I'm gonna tag these supplies and move on we'll let the rebels know where to find these supplies they can pay us back later we're out I'll meet you there Yeah, this is definitely a demanding game at this time. If you're running anything below probably a GTX 970, you're going to struggle with performance. Now, this is a closed beta, so we can't be too judgmental. Things will more than likely improve once the final game has been released. But I do love the way this is just open world. That's the, probably the biggest appeal about it. I just wish the performance was uh, a bit more consistent. Hmm. I want to investigate this. Seems like it's been 
burnt out so I imagine there's cartel members here knocking around and I'm more than happy to kill them Yep, just as I thought. Okay, just want to work out how how many I'm dealing with before I open fire. So we have got at least four guys. Uh, we got a lot of guys here, so I need to be careful if I want to do this stealthily. Stay quiet. Shut up. Okay, I don't want to make too much noise, so we need to take these guys out quietly. Okay. Okay, so that wasn't the best approach I've ever done. Man, these guys really got me. So we just gotta take the captain out now. That's it, all done. Good shooting. Let's clean up and move on. Okay, let's try and get to our destination. I'll use this um vehicle now, I'll leave the bikes alone. Hang on, I'll drive. So depending on where you are, performance goes from 30 to 40 frames per second, even at 1440p. So again, a very demanding game. Kingslayer will be dead in the water before it even starts. Let's go. Okay, there's a few of these guys that we need to kill. I got a third. I'm trying to think where to start. There's four. I got another. That's five. Okay. There's another one over there as well. There's a lot of guys to kill. We'll start with him. Okay, we're still all right. okay, his buddies didn't really realize that was going on. This guy over here seems a bit um, suspicious, so let's just wait for him to get out the line of sight of his buddies and we'll take him out as well. And we'll move in on the rest of them. Okay, we've laid him out. Let's move up. Trying to avoid a massive firefight here if we can. But if it comes down to it, we'll deal with that. So let's take this guy out before he returns to his buddies. Tango down. I got one narco by the shed. Okay. This guy's rolling around with some huge shotgun. I'm 
Let's take out your buddy. Watch him, I'll be searching for you. Hell, it sounds like you found a body. So they know we're here. They just don't know where at this moment. Okay, so this guy just came from the side. Didn't realize he was here. Right, he's down. I think we've got one more inside at least. So this guy is locked up. Are you Amaru? What's left of him anyway? Come on, I'm getting you out of here. Okay, we need to get this guy out of here. Let's get some ammo. Take him back to the car. Go ahead, I'll catch up. All right, so we've got to try and get this guy to safety. Pacatari has made his deal with the malditos extranjeros. Take it up with him, Senor. Driving mechanics ain't amazing, to be honest, but you know, it does the job, I guess. So, we're meant to get over there somewhere. Surprised there's no guys chasing me down. I thought that's exactly what would have happened by now. Um, I'm just looking for options to go off road, but it doesn't seem like I have got much choices. I do have to just follow the road, unfortunately. I don't seem to know how to drive properly either. Man, this game is huge. Just the scale of this place is just crazy. Hmm. I think we can go up here. I'm not sure where it will lead us, so I think I'll stick to the main road. And performance pretty does does pretty much suck on this game. Um, I'm interested to see how everyone else is getting on with this because um, I'm not impressed at the moment. But you know things will definitely have to improve um, before this game is released. That's for damn sure. Excuse my poor driving. Oh, 
Oh, we even dropped below 20 frames, 30 frames per second at that point. It was a cartel outpost, but because we got this high value target in tow, no point of risking him getting shot. That's someone driving a Lamborghini in the desert. <laughs> That's just funny, man. That looks so out of place. This is a pretty long drive. This is it. Check it out, weapons case. I'm somewhat disappointed. I thought there would be guys waiting for us. Some kind of ambush. So I've got myself a sniper rifle. Good to see. Are you hurt? Santa Blanca is not the most gracious of hosts. These aucas, these demons, they had questioning me. Let us see. Their talk of love was enough to make me vomit. But their methods were not. We're not. Were their names Yuri and Polito? See, si. Yuri Polito. These are the fucks that tortured Ricky Sandoval while Sueño questioned them. I want them bad. We only saw run of the mill Sicarios when we freed Amaru. But I haven't seen Yuri and Polito in at least three days, maybe four. I don't know where they are now. We need more intel. We'll search every village and camp until we find something. Somebody's got to know something. Gather documents, hack computers, interrogate hostile lieutenants, talk to civvies, whatever it takes. We'll turn over every rock. Okay guys, so that was my first look at um, Ghost Recon Badlands. Oh, it's Wildlands, sorry. Um, That's the rundown on La Yuri and El Polito. They're a key part of Santa Blanca's security operation. Looks like a good game. Check out Bowman's briefing on the chain of command. Guy in charge of security is El Muro, the wall, personal bodyguard and childhood friend to El Sueño. El Muro's little brother is La Plaga, nasty piece of shit. Very active on social media. Head Sicario for the cartel. The hunt starts now. We want Sueño, we gotta work our way up the hierarchy. First targets are Yuri and Polito. We find the intel, we track them down, we take them out. Okay, so... Game does need some work. Um, it is a closed beta, so they have plenty of time to optimize the game, but very demanding. Um, but it seems like it's going to be a fun game, so looking forward to seeing how it looks when it's finally released. Um, so anyway, guys, thanks very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video.